were you ever part of the whole craze around that film American Psycho? Do you remember hearing mm. about American Psycho? Based mm. on the Bret Easton Ellis uh, novel? Okay, well, the director, the woman who directed it, has directed a new film. And it stars, curiously, in the most... in a role that couldn't be more opposite to Prince Philip, Matt Smith. Try and guess what kind of emblematic, infamous, American figure, shady figure, Matt Smith could be playing in a, in a new film. Infamous, shady figure? Yeah. Dark, evil, depraved. Al Capone? No. Donald Trump? No. Charles Manson. Oh. Check this out. This is called Charlie Says. And I believe it's about three of his acolytes or disciples who are still held under the spell after his incarceration. Oh. True story. True story. In the same year that Tarantino's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood is being released, which is about, tangentially, is about the Sharon Tate murders. Oh, I thought that had already been released. No, 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 no. That's yeah, the yeah. big That's the big yeah. sort of indie Tarantino oh, okay. release of the year. That we're looking forward to that. I know everyone thinks we're these scary creatures who committed these horrible crimes, but we did what we had to do. I need your help with the Manson girls over in the special security unit. Good morning, ladies. I'd like you to meet Colleen Faith. Hi, Colleen. What is it you can really do for them? I just want to remind them who they were before they ever met Charles Manson. It's like being home again. The family before the crimes, when everything was about love. What do we have here? I'm Leslie. I think we should let her stay. You're going to be Lulu. We don't talk about our past. Our lives started when we met Charlie. Go ahead. We're all about love here. We got no secrets. We got no shame. Sometimes there has to be some depth of self, changes, tears. Are you willing to die for me? I want to go on an adventure. Get ready to fight. And if I die, will you come? Charlie taught us that death and life are the same thing, so there's nothing to be afraid of. Do you love me? Thrust and jab like you mean it. Thrust, jab. You wanted to believe something big was gonna happen. So baby, run. If you care for me. We're gonna go out and we're gonna get it right. There are real victims in this prison. Maybe these women are victims too. Your time is now, man. We did what we had to do. Right? So baby, you oh. take care of me. Charlie says. Oh, that looks good though, doesn't it? Doesn't it? That looks so good. He's such a versatile well, actor. Well, you see, it's all the stuff that I'm fascinated by as well, yeah. isn't it? It's like what drives people, what... You know, you can get... I think you can almost turn anyone if you get somebody at the right moment, in the right vulnerable state, yes. the right manipulative person. Could you have ever signed up to a cult? Have you had times in your life where you were so easily influenced or vulnerable? I wouldn't like to say... I would never like to fully stand in judgment because mm. we just never know. No. I mean, there will have been... The majority of those people will have been perfectly decent people. Yeah. But... I think Hannah... I mean, it's grooming, isn't it? Do yes. we believe in grooming? Yeah, exactly. So, you know, do we believe that paedophiles can groom? Do we believe that, I know, partners that batter can groom? Yes, so yeah. why couldn't somebody groom a cult? And, you know, and they start with love and they're obviously people that are disaffected or lost or lonely or whatever. So, yeah. It reminded me a bit of that... Do you remember the Elizabeth Olsen film, Martha Macy May, oh, which loved we loved? If you haven't seen that film, film so I think we've got that right. See, it's about really five years good. ago, four years ago. Well, longer than oh, that, my God, it was so good. It, it is Elizabeth Olsen's sort of gateway performance. It's, it's remarkable. But, uh, yeah, he looks very good. I, we're huge Matt Smith fans. And also, interestingly, too, the actors, Hannah Murray, I believe the girls, Maddie might know, I think she was in Skins or something. But that, oh. that girl there is Kevin Bacon's daughter, Sosie Bacon. God, yeah, really? She kind of looks like it. She does, actually, yeah. now you say now it. You say it. But, 
But um, I think that looks like a, an that interesting... That looks like a really intimate. hard watch, though. I'm always drawn I'm gonna to... I'm going to be sad. Yeah, it's going to be sad. I'm, I'm always drawn to the... Um, I love that sort of, what would you call it? The uh, psychedelia of, of America and California in the 70s. Mm. Uh, and there's a huge part of, it, obviously, the music, the scene and everything. But it's, it's becoming one of those decades where the more you peel back, obviously, Charles Manson, you didn't need to peel back, you knew it. But there's a lot of dodginess, dodginess at pl a play under there. And a lot of it but, tied into, and my mum often says this, mm. a lot of it tied into this reverse sexism of yeah. sp supposed liberation. Yeah. And that being you can just of, have sex with as yeah, many men as absolutely. we tell you to now. Yeah, exactly. We can just have as many of you as you want. Free love, free, free love. Free love suited a lot of men. Yeah. Really did. And I think How they convinced them. How good was free them. love for women, Exactly, really. exactly. 